Today I am going to be teaching you unit 5 poem The Lazy Frog. On a school day you are busy studying, playing and chatting with friends. When you have a holiday from school what do you do? Would you behave a little like the frog in the following poem? Fred is a very lazy frog who lolls all day upon a log. He always manages to shrug doing a single stroke of work. His poor old mother calls in vain, come in and help. He does not bother to move two inches, much preferring to be extremely hard of hearing. He lies there in a silent heap and stays conveniently asleep. If a lady frog hops past, you would think he would get up at last <clears throat> to bow and help her on her way. But no, I am ashamed to say that when a lady frog comes by, he does not open up one eye. So let's see the first stanza. Fred is a very lazy frog. Okay, He spends all time just lol, lol, uh, wasting, passing his time just lying down lolling around okay um his poor mother calls him okay the mother frog calls him to help her out in some work but he pays a deaf ear he doesn't even bother to hear her does it even bother to even help her out in some work he lies there in a silent heap and stays conveniently asleep he prefers to be asleep only the poor mother thinks ke, okay chalo now one lady frog will hop near him and he may open his eyes and at least look or bow his head in front of her and give her, her a helping hand but he does nothing of that. She feels totally ashamed ke, oh my god my frog my baby frog is not even bothered to see the lady frog or help help her give her a helping hand or Ask her, see her, nothing. He does nothing of that sort. So let's come to the written part. This is poem 9, The Lazy Frog. Meanings. Lol. To lie around lazily. The sentence. He lolled about in his pajamas all day. Second. Log. Trunk of a tree that has been cut. Sentence, you roll my log and I'll roll yours. Shrug, to not do something you should do. Sentence, the man tried to shrug his duties by pretending to be ill. Fourth, in vain, useless, uselessly. <clears throat> Sentence, the child tried in vain to stop the water flow. <clears throat> Fifth, prefer. Like something better. Sentence, I prefer coffee in the morning. Sixth, hard of hearing means deaf. Though he is a bit hard of hearing, he remains extremely sharp. Seventh, bow. To bend your head to show respect. Sentence. He gave a graceful bow to the audience. Question and answers. Question 1. What did the frog do all day? The answer is the frog keeps on resting on a log of wood the whole day. Second. Beside Besides lazy, what other word can you think of to describe the frog? The answer is, the frog beside, besides being lazy, he is also rude and proud. Next, complete the sentences with reference to the poem. That is question number three. First is, when the frog's mother called him, he pretended to sleep. 
the answer is sleep and the second one of question number 3 when a lady frog hops by he does not even open up one eye the answer is open up one eye page number 80 question number 4 <clears throat> did you did you like the frog's behavior so the answer is no i did not like the frog's behavior because he is very rude to his mother next refer to the poem and understand the frog loved to lay and lie around all day he does not like to do any work at all now make true sentences about yourself write about the people you like a game you play a hobby a habit you have you may use the following clues i love dash i like dash i don't mind i don't like i hate try and find out the same from your family members as well the answer is i love to play football i like to read books i don't mind doing my homework i don't like to go for shopping i hate watching television add one more matching word to each pair one has been done for you the first one log frog dog that has been already been done for you shirk work burp vein dain main next one clearing okay the next one is heap keep leap pass last cast way say lay what kind of words are they they are rhyming words <clears throat> okay 